The environmental movement spent an awful long time appealing mostly to the side of our brains that likes bar graphs and pie charts and all of that, and that's an important part. Um, you know, on those grounds alone, we should win these fights. If we were having a purely rational discussion of what should happen, uh, the results would be clear, but it's not a purely rational discussion, and it shouldn't be, because our hearts and our spirits are, are and should be involved as well, and that is what tonight is about, so there will be writers and songsters and people of all kinds. Together, we can overcome amazing obstacles. We can do so many things. We can withstand all challenges, achieve all things. And that's the big reason we're here again tonight. It's that freedom that those who profit from the status quo always try to hide from us. That connection. The connections are what they hope that we don't realize. They try to convince us that we're like a little finger that's out there on, the, uh, on our own, that's exposed and vulnerable and can easily be broken because it's alone and weak. They don't want us to remember that we're not just an isolated finger, but that we're connected to a hand that has many fingers that can unite as one fist. And that one fist cannot be easily broken. That one fist doesn't need to back down. That fist can hold its ground. And that fist is not a symbol of violence. That fist is a symbol that we will not be misled into thinking we are alone. Hold on. Keep your eyes on the prize. Hold on. Hold on. Hold on. Keep your eyes on the prize. Hold on. Uh, a few years ago, Alexandria uh, entered into a multi-year, multi-million dollar lawsuit with the uh, coal plant down the road, uh, formerly known as Mirren. The work we're doing at the state level, the work the CCAN is doing here on leading the effort to shut down the Potomac River coal plant is about not just also cutting pollution, but changing the politics so we can free up our elected officials to actually vote their conscience instead of their concern about the next election. This coal plant is an icon of everything that is wrong. In the middle of an urban area, we are burning coal without modern pollution controls that is literally killing people. Kids are having asthma attacks and missing school because of that filthy coal plant. And it's raising that awareness, as the council member indicated, that they have been trying for several years to make that happen. I'm convinced with the leadership of CCAN and others, we're gonna make this happen very, very soon. I became an environmentalist because I could not stand idly by and watch the destruction. If silence was consent, I would not be silent. Hold on, hold on. Keep your eyes on the prize, hold on. The only thing that I did wrong was stay in the wilderness too long. Keep your eyes on the prize, Miss. Hold on. Hold on. Hold on. Keep your eyes on the prize. Genon insists on burning mountaintop removal coal at this plant. And this isn't happening in some far off remote place. This is happening to our families right here in Virginia, to our neighbors in West Virginia and Kentucky. The mountains that we are losing every day are the Appalachians and they don't grow back. I'd like everyone to repeat after me, we are. We are. We are. We are. We are. The leaders. The leaders. We have been waiting for. We have been waiting for. Hold on, hold on. Keep your eyes on the prize, hold on. Eyes on the 
surprise. Oh. oh.